Hello, my lovely readers. Welcome to Living the Tales with me, Priyanka. I hope you're enjoying all the stories that I'm posting. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share. Are you ready for today's story? So this story talks about that it is okay to feel our feelings as they are normal and real. And at the same time, there are things we can do to help us calm down when our feelings get too big. Make sure to watch all the way through as in the end, I'm going to give quick shout out. So let's get started as we read together Feeling My Feelings book written and illustrated by Kim T. S. Feeling All My Feelings book Story and illustration by Kim T. S. Kyle is a little kid with a lot of big feelings. Feelings that he just can't hide. Feelings are important. They're all the things you feel inside. When Kyle feels sad, he cries so much that it's hard to stop. No, I don't want you to leave. When he feels happy, he smiles so much that his heart might pop. I love my monkey. Aww. When he feels scared, his heart beats fast as he runs and hides. What are you afraid of? When he feels brave, his heart beats fast as he conquers the slides. Whee! Yay! When he feels amused, he giggles and chuckles. <laughs> But when things get really funny, knock knock, who's there? Interrupting cow, interrupting cow, who? Moo! <laughs> he laughs till his knees buckle. <laughs> when he feels upset, he wants to scream and shout. No, it's mine! Share please. Sharing is caring. Sharing is painful! When he feels disappointed, he just sighs and pouts. Time to go. Oh, but I want to stay. When he feels under the weather, he lies down in bed all day. But when he feels energetic, he comes out to play. When he feels disgusted, he makes a yucky face. When he feels shy, he hides in a quiet place. So many big emotions for such a little child. Some can be extreme, some a bit mild. It's okay to feel all your feelings. You can't always help how you feel. It's important to remember that these feelings are normal and real. But when it feels too big for you, just remember that you have a secret superpower. Take a close look and you may find that you can tweak some of these feelings with your mind. Your mind is your superpower. You hold a key. You can feel more than one feeling. Just try it and see. When you feel sad, you can think of a happy thought to feel less bad. 
when you feel angry and find your face in a frown. You can take a deep breath to calm yourself down. When you feel scared like a shivering bunny, you can turn that thought into something that's funny. When you feel so disgusted that you wrinkle your nose, a really nice thought can help you through those. So don't let your feelings get the best of you. Life brings many challenges, but you can choose what to do. It will take time. Keep trying and stay true or the start of more to come just for you. The end. See you again soon. I hope you enjoyed the book. So today's shout out goes to Noel from Myanmar. Thank you Noel for reading, sharing and liking my stories. See you all soon. Bye bye.